All right, I'm about to do a video where these hound dogs are going to be all wound up. But before that, you need to see how they are in their normal state. Hey, big fella. You tired? He's alive, don't worry. Hey. Hey. Alright. Go back to sleep. Alright, there's another one over here. There's some front feet sticking out right here. Half covered up with one blanket. The other half covered up with another blanket. Where's he at? Oh, there he is. Hey. You trying to sleep? All right, Snap. I quit bothering you. Go to sleep. Okay, so this is what I call resting hound position. I'm going to show you the different states of hound dogs. So, in just a minute, I'm going to walk around that corner and I'm going to open the the drawer that all of their collars and leashes are in and then chaos will ensue all right here we go that bottom drawer there's one there's two what time is it boys what time is it are we going to the farm are we going to the farm yeah, yeah, we're going to the farm. All right, all right. Let's let's get them on. Let's get ready and go. You guys are ready. You guys are ready. Let's go. Let's go get in the truck, man. All right, come on, boys. Hey, in here. Come on, load up. Load up. Good boy, snap. Load up, track. Good boys. Good boys. Watching tails. All right. Snappy always rides shotgun. He likes to hang his head out the window. Tracker rides in the back because he likes to sit down in one of the seats and cry most of the way. All right, so we're signing off and uh, we'll be at the farm in just a few minutes. And we're gonna run some hounds. Uh, I got I got a co-pilot right here with me. I got one hanging his whole upper body out of the window, but he's all right. I, I mean, he's wedged in there pretty tight. I got the young fella right there helping me out. You not gonna sit in the back and cry? Huh? You ain't gonna sit in the back and cry? You almost got me back, huh? All right, so we have arrived. They're ready to get out and hit the road. Now, there's a little bit of animosity between the hounds and the big animals because these are, quote, predators and those are, quote, prey, but I'm more concerned about my prey killing one of my predators than anything. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Good boys. Oh, yeah, that's right. Mark your territory, son. All right, who are we going to introduce first? Who are we going to... Hey, Tracker. Tracker, come here. Come here, boy. Come here. Come here. This is Tracker. Tracker's my basset hound. Uh, we've had Tracker uh, about four and a half years. We got him when he was a puppy from... Hey, keeps going back to my same buddies, the ones that raise pigs. They also, for a time, will raise basset hounds. And uh, we got Tracker from them. A Tracker's still somewhat of a puppy. He's all basset hound. And I mean, I say that. Uh, he stinks. <laughs> like, like all basset hounds, I suppose. Um, he's four and a half. I think he's pointing. No, he's not pointing. He's peeing. <laughs> uh... And he still two stuff up every now and then. But hey, hey, he's my little boy. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yes. If you've seen the slow motion basset hound video, that was Mr. Tracker. He's actually friends with the cat, but he does chase the cat occasionally. Now, these boys listen pretty good. They listen pretty good. But in that sliver of time, that they don't listen, 
Not only do they not listen, it's like I'm not even in the world. So let's hope that doesn't happen today. Oh, but man, we got we got something good going on right here. And then Snappy, he's a he's what we call the alpha dog. He uh he's gonna mark everything that we come in contact with. Hey Snap, will you come here, bud? Snap, Snappy. Um. Oh, and they do have their names on their collars. Y'all gotta get a good look at Snappy. Snappy's like the pride and joy, the family dog. Hey, come here, bud. Come here, Snap. Come here, Snap. So, Snappy, we got him from the pound. We think he was a year old. We've had him about eight years, so we think he's about nine years old. And we think he's half Dotson, half Beagle. Snappy. I'm sorry. Snappy and tracker the key farm hounds i call them snap track all right come on boys come on come on we got it we got things to check out snap <laughs> come on boy we got things to check out come on basset hound he can run all day and never stop old snappy he'll get tired and uh we've walked down the road just for exercise and i've had to carry him back to the truck but he goes hard for a while come on son Now look, I try that stuff. Well, hey, they're just dogs. And, and at the end of the day, they are animals and not people. But I think it was, uh, I don't know, I read a quote one day. I think it, maybe it was Einstein. And he said, the more I learn about people, the more I like my dog. Well, you know, I'm all about loving God and loving people. And I struggle with the people part. But these guys here, they're, they're, not, they're not just dogs to us. I mean, they, li they live in our house with us. They used to sleep in a bed, but it's like trying to sleep next to 40-pound sacks of potatoes. Because once these guys go out, they do not move. So, um, I, can't, I can't do that. They're just dog stuff. Because to us, I guess they're more than dogs. But, they're not people. So Snappy found this low spot where water's been standing, and it is covered up with coon tracks. Oh, Snappy. See, that's why y'all hadn't been to the farm in two months, because it's been so wet. All right, so Snappy's got muddy feet. Look at all the coon tracks. We are covered up with raccoons. That's right, mark it, boy. Let them know who owns this place. Hey, Tracker, come on. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Trying to do this without having to give anybody a bath when I got back to the house. And then I look over and he is rolling in something. No doubt manure. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, you're nasty. Oh, you're so gross. Golly, come on. Come on. Alright, you're getting sprayed off with the water hose then. told him he better start listening. You better start listening. Snap out. The sniffer never stops. Hey. Not interested in doing an interview, huh? Alright. So, when it came to the manure thing, look, I knew that was possible. But he had walked past pile after pile after pile and he didn't roll any till he found a real juicy pile hound dogs so i was over here doing some shooting the other day and i was propped on this old table and apparently there is something interesting had been around this table we're checking it out what is it, guys? We finding any good stuff? So, now that you have been introduced to the Key Farm Hounds, 
This one wasn't a stinky hound when he got here, but he is now. Hey, Tracky, come here. Come here, Track. Come here. Now that you've been introduced to the boys, you'll probably see a lot more of them. Good boy, Track. Snappy and Tracker. Key Farm Hounds. All right, this is Chris from Key Farm. Love God, love people. Keep watching Key Farm. Puppy. Hey, my puppy. Hmm? You like coming to the farm? Yes. Yes, he loves the farm. Lots of good smells at the farm, huh? I think old Snap's starting to wear down. Snap, you getting tired, bud? Hey. You getting tired, bud? Huh? That tongue's hanging out. Ooh, you stink. Hey, that tongue's hanging out. You getting tired, my man? Yes. All right, now going home, it's a lot harder to load them than uh, when we go to... Hey! Hey! Load up! Tracker! Hey! Track! Hey, come on! Hey! Get in the truck! Get in the truck! Load up! Load up! Jump! Get in the truck. Come on, track. <laughs> Tracky. Tracky. Hey, come here. Come on. And uh, tracker. Oh, gun it. Hey. Come on. You want to get in on the side? I don't care. Uh oh, Snappy's in that seat. Load up. Watch your tail. Watch your tail. Yeah, that don't mean jump out this side. That don't mean jump out this side. All right. There you have it. The key farm hounds.